Hello and welcome back. In this lesson, we're going to get the Terraform CLI installed on your system. Uh, we'll take a look at the Terraform documentation for the download and installation of the Terraform CLI. Uh, I'll do a walkthrough of uh, installation on Mac OS, uh, but the instructions for Windows or Linux are very similar as well. So let's dive in. So to get started with installing the Terraform CLI, uh, just go to the terraform.io site, and then you should see the uh, download button here for the open source section. So let's click on that. Now at the time of recording here, the latest Terraform CLI version is 1.3.6. But if there's a new version like uh, 1.4 or 1.4.2 when you're watching this, uh, just grab the latest release. I'll do my best to make sure that all the hands-on labs throughout the course are backwards compatible with the latest versions or update the labs and lessons in the course if there's any kind of breaking changes with the uh, newer releases of Terraform. So next, I just want to draw your attention to this operating system section here. You can see we have uh, installation instructions for a variety of different operating systems for Mac OS, Windows, uh, Linux, uh, FreeBSD, OpenBSD, Solaris. So just pick the operating system that's applicable to you. Now for each of the operating system options, there's a number of ways we can download and install Terraform. Uh, for example, with Mac OS, we can use the Brew Package Manager, or we can do the uh, binary downloads as well. Then for Windows, we have the binary download options. And then for Linux, we have different installation instructions depending on the uh, distribution of Linux we're using. Um, we have the app-based package manager instructions here for uh, Ubuntu or Debian, uh, Yum for uh, CentOS and Red Hat. Um, we have the uh, dandified pack package manager for Fedora. Um, and then Amazon Linux as well, we have the Yum installation instructions. Now, this would be helpful if you're maybe uh, crafting a Amazon machine image or AMI uh, and you want the Terraform CLI built in. And this is a way you can install Terraform onto the uh, Amazon Linux image. And then if you use uh, Homebrew uh, with Linux, uh, there's also the same instructions here uh, as you'd find for Mac OS. Now for myself, I'm on a Mac, so I'm going to uh, use this option here. And uh, I'm going to use the Brew Package Manager installation steps. So a convenient way to uh, grab these commands is just hit this uh, copy button here. And that's going to copy those commands to our clipboard. So then you can just fire up your terminal and then paste those commands in. Now, I already have Terraform installed, so this is just going to take a few seconds. Uh, but in your case, it may take a few minutes to do the uh, brew update and uh, Terraform installation. So once your uh, Terraform installation is complete, uh, we can just run a, a Terraform dash dash version command. Uh, just to verify the Terraform CLI is installed and it's the proper version we expect. If you do run into any installation issues, there's a ton of documentation on the uh, Terraform website. Uh, as well, reach out on our Discord channel if uh, you have any additional questions or problems and uh, we'll do our best to help you out. In the next lesson, we'll go ahead and create a brand new AWS account and then do some uh, security housekeeping, uh, just making sure we have the security best practices in place on the account and also set up some budget alerts on the account to make sure we don't have any runaway costs and that we're alerted if there's anything kind of unusual happening that way. Um, and that's it for our Terraform CLI installation. Thanks for watching and see you in the next lesson.